Jammers, Hakeem Golden here, and today we're going to show you, yes you, how to record your vocals on Music Maker Jam. Let's get started, Jammers. In a burst of flames, everybody round here knows my name. How many times can I chase the game? How many times can I bring the pain? I'm gonna make you rain, but I'll still be hot. Told y'all before that I just can't stop. Everybody waiting on my album drop. One time for my man to fox. Magics loudly, I rep that proudly. Keep those beat coins stacked, cause I gotta get the brand new pack. Gotta get the brand new track. Gotta let them know I'm back. Go ahead and check these facts. Fact one, I'm a legendary king. Keep it 100. For my legendary team Fact 2 I'm vicious vibing Whole crew hungry We still surviving Fact 3 One sound one fam Rapping music Make it jam Woo! Okay jammers Let's talk about What we just did And how it works Um Firstly Uh In order to record With Music Maker Jam you do not need a microphone like I have here. You don't need a microphone. All you need is a pair of earbuds or some headphones um, so that you don't get any overlapping. Um, and you can actually use your, um, your uh, phone or your tablet's uh, mic to record. And some of them have really good qu uh, sound quality. And you can also buy a less expensive mic and still get really good sound quality out of less expensive microphones. Um, so what you want to do on uh, Android devices, this is a tutorial for Android devices, maybe I'll do one for iPhones a little later, and go down here to the microphone button over here on your kind of like top left hand side all the way at the bottom, if you go down to that icon for the microphones, then um, all of the sections up here at the top are actually going to have the microphone icon. Now, what's important to remember, because there's different ways that you can record, is this over here. And the top right corner, if you click on that little icon, you'll see repeat this part, repeat all parts, or play all parts and stop. Now, that's what I used um, because I, I like to uh, record either 8 to 16 bars at a time. But it's a lot easier just to record four bars at a time. <laughs> and you can do that, uh, you know, just recording on repeat this part so you don't go outside of the box and mess up other stuff or whatever. But um, how the recording works is when you hit this little icon right here, it's going to do a countdown. It will not record until the, after the countdown has finished. So let's hit the button. Now it's recording. You see, <laughs> you see how the um, music actually kicks in when it starts recording, or that's your cue to actually, you know, start singing or rapping or spoken word in literature, anything that it is that you want to do. So um, if you put it on like I did, play all parts, it's actually going to um, play all parts, of course. But it will always record in the exact same spot. I mean, if you're looking at this, it's always going to record in the exact same spot. So if you have any other instruments right here on your uh, other uh, bars or your other um, spots, I'm not. Sorry, I don't know what you call them. <laughs> um, it will record over them. Any instrument that's in this section that you start recording over, like a. Let's just look at this, um, for instance, uh, this Epic Swag F. If we record right here, of course, it'll give us the countdown. And let's pause it. And you see that? Well, it's disappeared. Hope you guys are catching that. And now is the recording that we just recorded. And see, it sounds horrible because we're not using any... Um, earbuds or headphones so you don't you want to make sure that you're using those so you don't get all of that you know 
static overlap or whatever, all of that noise. Um, but um, that's basically the long and short of it, guys. Um, if you're having latency issues, let's cover that real quick because we have time. If you're having problems with, you know, um, you can never get on the beat, it sounds like it's lagging behind, just go out here and uh, go to your um, settings icon and are you audio settings okay here we go go into audio settings and the easiest thing to do is hit this down here at the butt at the bottom that says estimate estimate automatically when you hit that it's going to tell you to unplug your headphones and everything and you hit that and it'll line it up for you automatically if you're still Feel a little off and you're sure that you know you're getting a little lag time during recording then you're going to want to play around with this area right here see if you can um, tighten it up a little bit see if you're a little behind or a little before but this is where this is the area that you want to be in go into settings go into audio settings and usually the the autos work perfect perfectly for me every time so uh, if you have any questions or comments, you know, please let me know and I'll do my best to get back with you in a timely fashion. You're probably wondering why I don't have my shirt off. <laughs> Other than the fact that it's hot under these white hot lights. Um, when I sing and stuff like that, uh, I can be wearing anything. But whenever I rap or try to go beast mode, I got to take my shirt off. <laughs> <laughs> so another tip you know whenever you're singing or rapping or literature make sure you're comfortable because it's going to be a lot easier and uh if you make a mistake or mess up or you know you hit the button and you realize it didn't actually hit the button and you've been doing your thing and it's not recording don't worry it happens to everybody just keep on going well jammers i hope you found this video entertaining and informative and if you have, then make sure you like, subscribe, and share, share, share. <laughs> Until next time, jammers, keep on jamming.